Yo, what up, everybody? I'm Matt. I'm Wes. Welcome back to another Talking with the Turners. Got a little busy, so we've been doing our thing. Uh, Wesley? Yeah. I'm going to talk about this uh, Monday Night Spectacular. It was a great guy. Well, I'm hold on, hold on. Where, we, where, where are we at? Come on, start that over. What you got? Who do we watch? Uh, Seahawks versus the Eagles. How it was, was it? It was a good game. Drew Locke finally started to put his Texas Prime back in. He's starting to drive down the field. And he's doing really good. The last drive was really good. He even said, I like the end of the game because I heard this thing on like uh, TikTok or something, whatever. Um, he said to in the huddle in the last play of the game, basically for the Seahawks, he said if Jackson Smith and Jigbo was one on one, um, he's gonna throw to him, and he did. And he perfectly. he said if you're open, I'm gonna throw you the pill. That's exactly what yeah. his words were. Dude's a stud. Yep. What, what a the, game. What a game. What a catch think? by Metcalf too. Now Metcalf one. was a monster at the end of that he game. Always okay, is. so I got a question for you. Do you think that Philly deserves a W in there? No. I don't think so either because uh, at the end of the game, the, the 12th man for the Seahawks, you know, the stadium, the 12th man mm -hmm. or whatever, uh, boy, they came to life and they just took momentum. Then they got that very, if you watch the game, Love X Giant, uh, I, at first, I didn't think he picked it because he just flew out of bounds like a bat out of, you know, whatever. Uh, he caught it. Both feet touched that interception to, to end the game basically with six seconds as uh, Hertz was driving with the Eagles. And he has the flu. What did he still have he the flu? He had the flu. But, uh, Thought it was Michael. The drive was prime, man. The drive was prime from uh, Break Locke. Hatch. Drew Locke. Drew Locke. The kid's a stud. I watched it, uh, the interview after the game. He's just tearing up, dude. Like, he, he, he was just tearing up, you know. He, he didn't know what to say. He gave love to everyone on the team. Every person, except the water boy, which he probably did after the interview. Like, the dude is living in the moment right there, for sure. Yeah. For sure, for sure. Mm hmm But uh, we just wanted to run down the Eagles, Seahawks, uh, Monday night, spectacular. Pete Carroll's 8-0 on the Eagles. It's an interesting stat I never and knew. And he's 80. 72. He's the oldest coach, but in my opinion, one of the best coach. But people don't think so because of what happened with SC. Hey, it is what it is. That was a good game, too. Fight on Trojans. Go Seahawks in that pretty badass win. It was a good one. Yeah, so we're going to keep this one short. Yep. Uh, we'll be back Friday. Peace. Until next time, world.